Good morning, my name is Mr. Noel and welcome to Angelus Institute Simulation Lab. Today I will be showing you the proper technique of administering nasogastric tube medication. First and foremost, we need to check our medication, verifying the time, date, and dosage. Then we need to check our patient's allergy, explain our procedure to our patient, follow patient's six rights, then follow specific medication directions. Raise the head of the bed to a 45 degrees angle. Then we must stop our feeding pump Then we need to access our Lopez valve, turn the knob to stop the flow, and put on our clean gloves. Check for placing of RG tube using our syringe. Draw 30 cc of air to instill into the tube. Auscultate for a swishing sound over the stomach using our stethoscope. Check for residual by drawing the syringe back, and if you feel any kind of resistance, it's considered normal. Any residual that's above 100 cc, we need to hold the medication and stop the feeding. Crush any pills or open any capsule and dissolve in 15 ml of water. Make sure that we place a towel over our patient. Take the syringe and pull out the plunger. Attach it to our Lopez valve. Do an initial flushing of 15 ml of water. Followed next by our medication. After medication administration, follow another flush of 15 ml of water. Then we remove the syringe and replace our plunger back in. Take off the gloves and perform our hand hygiene. Lastly, we need to document our procedure, including the medications administered, date and time it was given, the amount of residual, and the amount of fluid administered in our INO record. Thank you for watching Angelus Institute Simulation Lab. Have a great day.